Hello and welcome to my channel. Uh, today I uh, went to Taco Bell and I'm going to be trying and reviewing the uh, Steak and Bacon Grilled Cheese Burrito, which is a new and uh, a limited time, I believe, offering on their menu. And I got it in a uh, combo, so uh, we'll be having a taco with it. Let's have a look. Alrighty, this is the steak and bacon grilled cheese burrito. It has, of course, steak, bacon, nacho cheese sauce, a three cheese blend, potatoes, reduced fat, sour cream, and chipotle sauce. If I bought this by itself, it would be $5.99, has 700 calories. For With the combo, uh, the combo would normally come with a... Uh, crunchy taco for $8.99, but uh, I customized to a soft taco supreme, which added 90 cents, so this is $9.89, and also it comes with a soft drink. In this case, I got a Diet Pepsi. Those of you that know me know I'm generally a coffee drinker, but a soft drink was all that was offered. Speaking of which, if you would like to support this channel, you may do so by buying me a coffee. Go to buymeacoffee.com slash cynical introvert or click the link on my page. Um, anyway, the, the reason I got the combo, well, there are a couple of reasons. One, if I just reviewed this, and you can see by the size, they're not, not huge, it would be a mighty short video, but also... I did one other Taco Bell review. You can find it on my uh, channel. Please watch it if you haven't done so already. At which time I got a, I think it was called a big game box. It had several items and I did, and you are allowed to customize each of the items. I did seven customizations of which they missed seven. They didn't get a single one. Uh, again, if you look at that video, be more details, but I wanted to give them another chance. So we'll see, this is this was very simple. I didn't uh, ask for a lot of uh, specific changes. I just swapped out a regular crunchy taco for the uh, soft taco supreme. Anyway, let's give these a try. Incidentally, I didn't mention uh, the soft taco supreme is uh, of course, a soft shell and uh, beef, lettuce, sour cream, cheese, and tomatoes. Anyway, let's get started with the steak and bacon grilled cheese burrito. Little melted cheese coming out the side, but here we go. Alrighty, um, the outer uh, shell, um, I don't know if it's a tortilla or what the uh, burrito shell is, but um, it, it's not uh, too doughy, it, it has a decent flavor, the texture is fine, again it seems to have a cheese coating around the outside, I can taste the meat inside. I taste the bacon more than I taste the, the uh, beef. But still, it has a decent flavor. Um, not really tasting the sour cream, but I uh, do taste the cheese and the chipotle sauce. Ever so slight bit of heat, but not terribly uh, spicy. The one thing it is terribly, it is terribly salty. Um, I'm not a person who uh, eats a lot of Mexican food. I don't go to Taco Bell very often. So my rating is just 
my opinion and not what you would call an expert or an educated opinion, but my rating system, uh, one would be something barely edible. Um, 10 would be the best thing I've ever had. Five is average. If this weren't so salty, it would probably be close to a six and a half or a seven. As it is, it is mighty salty, although it's not a bad flavor. I'm going to give it a five and a half. It's just slightly above an average thing. Now let's look at the Soft Taco Supreme. Simply because the last time I ordered, this was one of the substitutions I made on my last order that they screwed up and just gave me a plain old crunchy taco. Anyway, give this a try. All right, this I definitely taste all the ingredients. Again, I like the soft uh, shell. I taste the cheese, lettuce, tomatoes, the beef, the seasonings. It's actually quite good. Um, again, I'm not a connoisseur of tacos, but this is slightly above your average taco. I would give this about a six or a six and a half. And I'll give credit where credit is due, because if you watch my last Taco Bell review video, uh, I wasn't happy at all, but uh, they got the order right. Um, I know it says something about the world we live in today when you have to be happy and surprised because they did their job right, but credit where credit is due. The order was done properly. Um, the food was tasty. And uh, that is my review of Taco Bell's Steak and Bacon Grilled Cheese Burrito Combo. I didn't rate the Diet Pepsi. A Diet Pepsi is a Diet Pepsi, although it is kind of syrupy, which is a good thing. Incidentally, it comes with a large Diet Pepsi. I'm not sure of the ounces. I'm going to guess that uh, it, it looks like about a 20 ounce, but I could be wrong. Anyway, thank you for watching. Please like my videos. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. Please share my videos. Thank you and come again.